Nairiti? Yes, Mama. Today we will do divisibility by 4. Okay? Okay, Mama. We already did divisibility by 2 and 3. Okay, so today we will learn divisibility by 4. Okay. So let me explain you what is divisibility by 4. What are the tricks we use? Okay? Okay, Mama. A number is divisible by 4 if the number formed by the last two digit is divisible by 4 or if both the digits are zeros. Okay? Okay, Mama. If both the digits are zeros. Nerithi, so let me explain you with an example. Okay, Mama. 124 is suppose is the number. Okay? Okay, Mama. So what are the last two digits? Two, 24. 2 and, and 4. 4. Not 24. 2 and 4. So the number formed is 24. Right? Yes, Mama. 2 is in the tens place and 4 is in the ones place. place. Okay? So 24 is divisible by 4. Isn't it? In 4 yes, times Mama. table you 4, 6 are 24. 4, 6 are 24. So 24 is divisible by 4. So 124 is also, also divisible, divisible by 4. So you got it? Yes, Mama. So, so you need to look the last two digits. So read the rule. A number is divisible if the number formed by the last two digits is divisible by 4 or if both the digits are zeros. Yes, if it is divisible by, if both the numbers are divisible by 4, then it is divisible by 4 or if the last two digits are both the digits are 0, then also the number is divisible by 4. 4. Okay? Okay, Mama. So, let me give you an example. Let me see whether you can do or not. 108. 108. Write the number. 108. Okay, write number 1. 108. Move the little side, that side. Yes. So, what are the last two digits? 0 and 8. So, in tens place 0, does that make any value? No. 0, 8. So, what is the number we are getting? 8. 8. Is 8 divisible by 4? Yes, mama. 8 is divisible by 4. What are the numbers? Form? 0 and 8. 0 and 8. So, from there what we get? 0 and 8. Does 0 make any sense? No, Mama. So, what we are getting from there? 8. 8. Only 8. Yes, very good. 8 is divisible. by 4. So, 8 is divisible by 4. That means 108 is also divisible by 4. Isn't it? So, 108 is also divisible by 4. Yes. Yes, Mama. Very good. Yeah. That indicates that 108 is also divisible by 4. Divisible by 4. So, you understood the process? Yes, Mama. Okay, very good. Let me give you another one. The next number is 194. 194. 194. So, what you are going to do? We have to find the last two digits. Yeah. The last two digits is 94. 94. 94 are the last two digits on its extreme right. The right side you need to see. The extreme right is 94. Yes. Is 94 divisible by 4? Let me check, Mama. Okay. You count and do what you are doing.
Tell you count what you are doing. Count the tables loudly. Four ones are four. Okay, now if you have done it. Now do. What you are getting? The so, remainder is two. So is it divisible? No, mama. So ninety four is not divisible by four. Four. So ninety four is, is yes not divisible. by 4 why it's not divisible by 4 because the remainder is 2 the remainder we got the remainder if the remainder is double zero then it is divisible by 4 double zero or zero right yes ma then it is divisible by 4 so is 194 is divisible by 4 no mama 194 is also not divisible by 4, four. so we did Two sums, one number is divisible by 4 and, and one number is not divisible by 4. Okay. So, shall we move to the third one? Yes, Mama. Okay. Let me give you a five digit number. Let me check whether you can do or not. The number is 56,724 divisible by 4 or not. 56,000 50, 7,024 724 Tell me clearly so that I can understand that whether you understood or not. The last two digits are 24. 2 and 4. 2 and 4. 2 and 4 from those digits the number formed is 24. 24. Then twenty four is divisible by four. How you know? Because six four is twenty four. Very good. So twenty four. So twenty four is divisible. Divisible. By four. So what? Tell me. So from here, what you come to know? That twenty four is also divisible by four. Twenty four is divisible by four. We know. So which number? Tell me the number. Read the number. The the number. 56,724 is also divisible by 4. So, 56,724 is also divisible by 4. four. So, it's clear now? Yes, Mama. So, did you understood divisibility by 4? Yes, Mama. I hope what are the numbers given you can tell whether it is divisible or not? Yes, Mama. Whether it's a big number or a small number, you can tell, right? Yes. Okay. Thanks for watching the video.